It is difficult to reconcile the ideas of different schools of thought on the question of education. Some people maintain that pupils of schools should concentrate on a narrow range of subjects, which will benefit them directly in their subsequent careers. Others contend that they should study a wide range of subjects, so that they not only have the specialized knowledge necessary for their chosen careers, but also sound general knowledge about the world they will have to work and live in. Supporters of the first theory state that the greatest contributions to civilization are made by those who are expert in their trade or profession. Those on the other side say that unless they have a broad general education, the experts will be too narrow in their outlook to have sympathy with their fellows or a proper sense of responsibility towards humanity as a whole. School of thought can be best explained as Option A, group of people who are school to think, no. School of thought ke meaning hote hai ke group of people jo kisi ek matter ke upar different opinion rakhte hoon. B, group of people having different perception on particular subject, yes. Ye iska correct answer hai. Groups of people belonging to different schools, no. Group of people whose job is to think, no. जैसे कि डेफिनेशन के मुताबिक स्कूल ऑफ थॉट की मीनिंग है ग्रुप ऑफ पीपल जिसमें लोग डिफरेंट ओपिनियन रखते हों एक पर्टिकुलर टॉपिक पर तो इसलिए इस क्वेश्चन का करेक्ट आंसर है ऑप्शन बी